criminal. Thanks to the hard work of Steve and Guido, you are hereby sentenced to death. Adventurers, thank you so much for bringing this piece of filth in. Today, he shall pay for his crimes. Yeah, buddy, no problem. Um, one little thing. Did you just say death? You're really going to kill this guy? That seems like a little bit too much. Yes, didn't the guy only steal some apples? Surely that doesn't mean he should die. Ah, uh, you see, Robot, that is where you are wrong. They were some of my daughter's apples, and for that, he must pay. Oh, Guido, I don't think he's listening to me. Look, the Huacha is moving forward. Oh, gosh, the poor guy looks so nervous. All right, Guido, cover your eyes. This could be messy. Oh, my goodness. Are those snakes? Oh, my gosh. Oh, he's been pinned against the wall. Oh, my goodness me. Oh, the snakes are writhing everywhere. Oh, my gosh. This is so brutal. Oh, my gosh, a second helping. Yeah, I think you got him. Ah, oh, wonderful. Now that that is dealt with, Steve, I have another very important mission for you. There are several units throughout the Tabs Dimension who have been targeted by a mysterious mutant assassin known only as the Blink Master. A result of alchemy and dark magic, this ruthless creature has the ability to phase through time itself. Take this list. It is everyone that the Blink Master will be targeting. Stop the assassin, and there is a healthy reward waiting for you. Healthy reward? Like a banana? Or an orange? Or maybe even an apple? I know how passionate you guys are about those. You know what, Guido? Something tells me he's not talking about fruit. I think he's talking about fame and fortune, which is exactly what I need in my life right now. Let's do it. Let's get out there and let's find this assassin. Hey Guido, so we found our very first target. We're here in the tribal sandbox to protect this guy, the Chieftain. Although right now, he looks like he's pretty well protected anyway. I see some spear throwers, some shield protectors. Yeah, this guy doesn't look too bad. Listen dude, I think there's a very easy way that we can kind of skip past all the hard work and just get to our reward at the end. Really? That sounds good. Awesome, I'm glad you're on board. So this is what we do. As I said, it already looks like the Chieftain is pretty well protected. So we just let his guards do their jobs and protect him. And then once the Blink Master's dead, we move in with some kind of giant net, preferably throw it over him, tie him up, bring him back to the Renaissance faction, and get our reward. And what happens if the Blink Master manages to kill the Chieftain? Look, we're just going to have to trust that that doesn't happen. Uh... Say, I think that was him there. Yeah, Guido, I'm pretty sure the Blink Master is here. Yes, there he is. Look at him. He's actually kind of handsome. Will you stop? Oh, I'm sorry, dude. I need to remember that this guy is one evil son of a gun. Born in the darkness, bred to kill. This guy is an assassin. So I probably shouldn't compliment him, yes. And we are off. It looks like the Chieftain and his men managed to spot him in the distance and are now marching valiantly towards him. Now, it's important to remember that the Chieftain doesn't know he's been targeted by this guy. This is just a stranger to them. Okay, get some range throws in there and just take him down, please. Come on, spear throwers. Oh, he's blinking everywhere. This is not good. And oh, he just took the Chieftain down straight away. And it looks like, my gosh, he's actually quite slow. For an assassin, he's very clumsy. It looks like he can block and deflect all of those spears apart from one, apparently, which is sticking out of his arm. And now he's just moving through each one of these soldiers and these guards. He looks like he got a spear right to the shoulder there, but he's still moving. <laughs> Oh my goodness, dude. I didn't realize that <coughs> a teleporting Blink Master could cause so much smoke. Guido, are you okay? <laughs> oh my gosh, I can't see. Agreed, dude. Look, let's just get out of here. Let's find the next target and help them. So you see, Mr. Wheelbarrow, you are being targeted by the Blink Master, a deadly assassin that can phase through time itself. 
Now will you listen to me? Y'all think I'm scared of some pesky assassin? That's exactly why I hired my sons here to push me around all day in this wheelbarrow. Help us! He also makes us shower him as well! Quiet there, Eric! No, I'm not worried about some pesky assassin, because I've got something that not even he has. Speed. Okay, I appreciate that you're very proud of your sons for kind of driving you around all day, making sure that you move around very fast, but I just want to rephrase something. This guy can teleport, okay, are you still with me? He can teleport through time. That means that he's going to be faster than your wheelbarrow! Idiot! And here we go, let's see exactly if his wheelbarrow is faster than teleporting. Oh my gosh! It actually might be. They're running around in circles from this guy. Oh my goodness me. I can't believe it, but I'm eating my own words. Um, oh my gosh. I can't believe this is happening. Uh, oh, no, there goes the wheelbarrow. Well, that didn't last long. Look, Guido, our next target resides on the pirate beach. We need to get there right now, and this time, I'm not going to take no for an answer. He can either accept my protection or die. And that, Mr. Pirate Captain, is really why you should accept my help. Um, I'll give you a few minutes to decide, you know, chat with your parrots or something. <coughs> and then come back to me with an answer. Because I promise you, if you give me, let's say, two million dollars worth of gold, I will create a great army for you. And Sold. I Oh. Of course I'll give you some gold to protect me. I mean, the rest of my crew have already been picked off by the Blinkmaster, Yar. I think he was trying to isolate me. Go ahead and take a few pennies from me stash. Oh, thank you. Uh, yeah, will do. Okay, Guido, I want you to save some of these for later. You both have ten minutes to form me the finest army you can muster. Ten minutes?! Okay, Guido, uh, let's start making some calls. Okay, Mr. Pirate Captain, we have our army assembled. It's really the best we could do in 10 minutes. No worries, lads. I have complete and utter faith in you. What the heck is that? It's only the best darn army you've ever seen. <laughs> Let me go ahead and talk you through each one. We've got a fencer with some very nice looking pants at least. A horse with no rider, so it's literally just a random wild horse. Um, blame Guido for that one. The Stoner Brothers. One only has one foot and the other one has no feet whatsoever, so they may not be very useful. But you're gonna like this one. We have a very powerful unit right here. It's... Wait, Guido, what happened to Artemis? Um, you should ask the Rancer, Steve. Uh, oh gosh, Guido, it looks like the Blinkmaster is here already, and he's going to battle with this horse. He jumped on the horse for a second. Oh my goodness. And it looks like the horse actually might be taking this guy down. I can't... Oh no, never mind. Okay, oh, did you see that dodge from the fence? That was amazing. Okay, the pirate captain... <gasps> He's getting involved! They managed to take down the Blinkmaster! I can't believe it! Oh my gosh, Guido, I can't believe that stupid army worked! <laughs> Ten minutes it took us! Ten minutes it took us to... Wait, what is that? Guido! No! Guido! Where is the Blinkmaster? <sighs> okay, dude, we managed to find him. It took us a little while, but we found him here at this ancient villa placed in the ancient fields. Luckily... It's just him. I don't really know how he managed to recover from being shot, but, uh... Um, Steve, I don't want to alarm you, but there's more of them. Oh my gosh, Guido, you're right! Four Blinkmasters. They must all be the same Blinkmaster, teleported in from different points in time. Oh, this guy's a crafty one. Okay, look, Guido, this might not be an issue just yet because we have assembled our own army. Now, what I've got here are brawlers, stoners, and farmers. I managed to pay everyone using the remainder of that pirate stash. Say, who did you get? On your left, Steve. Horses? Again? Where do you keep finding these guys, and why don't you bring any riders with you? To be honest, they did impress last time. And here we go, the battle for the ancient field is beginning. What are those horses doing? 
Some of them are just falling over straight away and just spinning around. Okay, luckily this time... Oh, oh, he's on top again. Oh, he managed to just destroy them. The stoners are throwing absolutely everything right now. And, oh my goodness, all the Blink Masters are converging right in the center of this group here. Hopefully, we can deal some serious damage. But right now, it looks like just everyone is being slowly but surely taken down by... Oh my goodness me, we haven't taken down... Oh. I think we've taken down one Blink Master, but three still stand. Okay, Guido, luckily the Raptor army are here as well to hopefully help out. Oh my gosh, is he literally just eating that guy? Get off his butt. There we go. Okay, he tried to get a, a midday snack there. Oh gosh, he just got slain. No, he didn't. He's back up. I think these Raptors might be too fast for the uh, Blink Masters here, or at least they're causing some kind of distraction, which is great. Let's see what's going on over here. It's Raptors on Blink Masters right here. I think we may have taken one of them down. Yes, one of them is down. So that leaves one here. And, oh, there's only two remaining. Oh my goodness me, those horses just got launched. So now, all that's left are stoners and brawlers here. Come on. Come on, we need to be able to do this. How's that, Blink Master? One Blink Master's down. Okay. Come on, stoners. Launch all your rocks right now. That's exactly what we need. Please, any time now would be great. I know you're thinking about it. There we go. Yes. Yes. Oh my goodness me. We did it! And all it took was a bit of good old-fashioned raptor distraction. Now, Guido, on to more important things. Guido, four Blinkmaster bodies means four times the reward, right? Surely. 